everyone. It's Miss Brittany. How are you today? I hope you're doing well. Uh, today we are going to do a social emotional lesson and we're going to work on naming some feelings and how to see other people's feelings. So we are going to look at this card. So last week we talked about being happy. Can you show me your happy face? Oh, that's a very good happy face. All right, so now this week, let's look at this card. This is Ethan. He likes to read books. Ethan's friend Danny brought a new book to school. Would you like to read my new book? Danny asked. Ethan opened the book and looked at the pictures. He turned to the next page and, wow, part of the picture popped right up from the book. It was a pop-up book and he didn't know it. How do you think Ethan is feeling? He is feeling surprised. Look at his face. Do you see how his face is showing surprised? His mouth is wide open and his eyebrows are up and his, his eyes are, are big open too. Looking at someone's face is a way to tell how he or she is feeling. So see, he's got a big open mouth and big eyes and his eyebrows up. Oh, he's so surprised. Another way to tell how someone is feeling is to focus attention on what's happening. So you can take your attention scope and look at what's happening. So you can think about what happened in the story. So why, why would you think Ethan is making this face? What do you think? Hmm. Because he didn't know the book was a pop-up book. He didn't know that some of the pages were going to pop up on the book. That was surprising to him. When you are surprised, you show that you did not know something was going to happen. And Ethan didn't know that about the book. <clears throat> so let's pretend that you are surprised. Can you show me and a grown-up around you uh, your surprise face? Very good. Now, let's think of the kinds of things that might make you feel surprised. Hmm. What about when you get a present and you open up that present and oh, it's such a cool toy? Or maybe you're building a tower and then oh, all of a sudden it falls down? Or what if someone's coming to visit you and you didn't know? And then you open the door and there they are. Those are all things that could cause you to be surprised. So now you can, we know about surprise, but one thing that's important to remember is how we can see how other people are feeling. So we've talked about looking at their faces, but it's very important to see what's happening. So let's say, hmm, someone is feeling something. Let's say someone is feeling happy. We learned about happy last week. So you see someone is happy. You can look at what is happening to see why they're happy. And you can do that with surprise too. And you can also take a mirror, look in the mirror and make your surprised face. Now I'm going to teach you a song about your feelings. So we're going to do happy because we learned happy last week and then surprised. Are you ready? If you're happy and you know it, make a smile. If you're happy and you know it, make a smile. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, make a smile. If you're happy and you know it, say hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, say hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it, happy and you know it, say hooray, hooray. Now let's do surprised. If you're surprised and you know it, make big eyes. If you're surprised and you know it, make big eyes. If you're surprised and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're surprised and you know it, make big eyes. If you're surprised and you know it, say wow, wow. If you're surprised and you know it, say wow, wow. If you're surprised and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're surprised and you know it, say wow, wow. 
you can make up some other verses to this song too with um, other feelings. You could do sad or mad. I can't wait to see your surprise faces. Make sure you take pictures and put them on Facebook or send them to your teacher. And I can't wait to see those faces. Bye.